Not too far away, in the land of Astoria, there lived a young girl named Robin. She was kind and loved taking care of the world around her, but inside she was still curious about the world that lay beyond. Suddenly, a terrifying noise echoed from beyond the village gate. Robin was surrounded by smoke and cinders. She needed to keep everyone safe. I can't let her get away. Robin pursued the beast with little thought for her own safety. I have to find out why a dragon attacked my village. Her hope was shattered. Why is this happening? It is fair! I felt so confused. A cold determination gripped her. She was ready. Lost Words Beyond the Page is a narrative-driven, atmospheric puzzler set inside the pages of an aspiring writer's diary. In an intricate story penned by renowned games writer Rihanna Pratchett, you will discover the inner thoughts of Izzy, our young protagonist. Explore the wondrous fantasy world of Astoria through the pages of Izzy's diary, where words wield immense power. Throughout the game, you will interact with the words themselves to solve a variety of puzzles and unique platforming segments to progress through an evolving landscape and world. Throughout the story, you'll be along for the ride as Izzy reflects on the transformational moments of her young life and copes with hardships that seem too big to be real in the eyes of a child. With insights drawn from working with child psychologists, the sometimes tense but always beautiful story will connect you with Izzy and her real life experiences as they play out in her personal journal and fantasy world. The game is split into two worlds, the pages of Izzy's journal and Astoria, the fantasy world Izzy begins to write about. While navigating through the journal, you will interact with words as well as drawings as you jump across the different platforms page by page. Discover hidden thoughts, traverse the words themselves and move them around to help complete Izzy's story. At the end of every chapter, you'll be transported beyond the page to Astoria. In Astoria, the adventure continues. Once you acquire your magic book, you will be able to collect and call upon certain words that have immense power. In your travels, you will encounter colorful characters with sage knowledge to pass down. You may even cross paths with a foreboding dragon that roams the skies. Lost Words is now available on Stadia. Hello, Journal. This time of the year, it gets dark so early, like the day is just an accident, and the night is how the world really works. Stars and fireflies glowing in the dark. I've never actually seen a firefly. Do you think that matters, Journal? Glowing things are cool, especially in nature. On holiday in Wales, Gran and I would go to the beach and look up at the stars. But one night, we looked down instead. The stars were shining in the water. It was like the sky got flipped upside down. We took off our shoes and socks and waded into the water. As we walked over the pebbles, They glowed beneath our toes. Gran said it was called bioluminescence. Tiny plankton in the water being moved back and forth by the tide. I knew it was just little creatures, but it felt like magic. Gran bought some special algae 
that would grow at home. We spent the whole day planning it. Lights. Sand. Pebbles. Corals. Glass stones. A house. Company. Water. We took pictures for Gran's photo album, for our future selves to remember. How the tank took ages to fill. How we took turns stirring the algae in. How happy we were when we had it all set. Just needs time to develop, said Gran. After six days, the algae was ready. I put the tank on my desk and ran my finger through the water. My own bit of magic. Mum, she just got a call. She has to leave now. It sounded really bad. I have a weird feeling in my stomach. Robin woke from a hazy, distant dream. Something unnatural had stirred her from slumber. Elder Ava? Robin, a giant creature is attacking our village. Attacking? I thought the fireflies protected us. There must be something wrong. Get to the tree at once. Hurry! What creature could have caused this? And suddenly, Robin was surrounded by smoke and cinders. As she hurried past the crackling rooftops, her concern grew. Hey, Robin! You gotta hide! You can hide with us! The note! There's no space! Um... Okay, find your own hiding spot then. No, no, no. I need to get to the firefly tree. How am I going to cross this? The bridge was beyond repair. Okay. What's that? noise echoed from beyond the village gate. Robin rushed out to meet it. Soon she would prove herself as the new village guardian. But things were about to get worse. Much, much worse. 